This video is sponsored by the Inky List. Hello everyone, so today I have five super easy hairstyles. I swear, these only take me like two minutes to do and these are my most worn daily hairstyles. You know, the ones that I show you guys, I'm really proud of them, but sometimes it can be a little bit complex to do. But for day-to-day -day wear, these are the hairstyles that I wear the most. So I'm really excited to share them with you guys because I think that they're really cute and some of them don't even require bobby pins or hair ties or anything to keep them up. Before we get started with this video, a little bit about our sponsor, The Inky List. So first to prep my hair, I'm using this amazing product that they have called the PCA Bond Repair Hair Treatment. And after having bleached hair and color treated hair for so long, Bond Repair Hair Treatments are actually my favorite in my hair care routine. It has this really lightweight spray on texture, which I find to be really comfortable for my hair. It doesn't weigh it down like some Bond Repairs do. It has innovative bond building technology that protects, strengthens, and also helps repair damaged hair. And the results are that my hair looks healthier and less damaged, and it also looks smoother and less frizzy. I already naturally have very frizzy hair. You just don't really often see it on camera, but it is something that I struggle with a lot of the time. These three products from the Inky List definitely really help with that. And then following up, this is the most unique and most lightweight hair oil that I've ever tried. And again, I'm always looking for something that helps calm the frizziness in my hair, but I also don't want to weigh it down at the same time. And this is the perfect hair oil for me to address those concerns. It's non-greasy, but it also really helps hydrate and nourish my dry hair. And then after curling and drying my hair, I'm going to use the final product to prep my hair for this video, and that is the Hyaluronic Acid Hydrating Treatment. It's a classic ingredient. We all love it for our skin, but the Inky List has also actually formulated a way to use it for your hair as well. So this works as a lightweight serum for your hair, and it also helps to protect your hair against pollution. And it makes my curls look so much smoother and so much bouncier. So my favorite thing about the Inky List is actually that all of their products are extremely affordable. Everything that I've mentioned in this video is $13 and less. And they also have products available for every single hair type and every single hair texture. And they also have this really cool hair recipe builder on their website at theinkylist.com so that you can figure out what products would be best to address your personal hair and scalp needs. They also have this amazing service, Ask Inky, which is available 24-7, 365 days of the year on multiple platforms. So you can find them through their website or their social media so that they can answer any of your skincare, hair care, or ingredient related questions. So thank you so much to the Inky List for sponsoring this video and let's get started with this tutorial. So in this video, I'm not going to use any hair ties or any bobby pins. I'm only going to be using clips in some of these hairstyles. So if you have any sort of large hair clip or hair claw, that would be perfect for this video. In this video, I'm using these really adorable acrylic butterfly hair clips. They come in a ton of different colors and it's honestly my favorite summer hair accessory. So our first hairstyle is my favorite lazy day hairstyle. I wear this really, really often, especially when I'm going out to see some friends casually. So I'm starting off with splitting my hair straight down the back and then taking one side of my hair. I'm starting at the top and I'm starting to just really loosely twist away from my face. And then I'm continuing to twist away from my face about halfway down my hair. And then taking this hair, I'm just looping it upwards and holding it against my head and then clipping that in place with a hair clip. And then I'm just going to repeat this on the other side. And this is my fun little take on twin tails. Honestly, when I wear twin tails throughout the day, my head starts to hurt so bad because of all of the hair ties to keep it in place. And this is just a really comfortable way to wear twin tails instead. This is actually my favorite hairstyle to wear when I have like three day curls or four day curls because my curls aren't looking as great or as bouncy, but by putting them up like this, they look really, really cute and more full. For our next hairstyle, I'm continuing with my hair split down the back and then I'm just twisting away from my face and I'm twisting until it collapses onto itself into a little bun. And then I'm taking again my same butterfly clip and I'm clipping this towards the front right behind my ear. And then I'm just repeating on the other side. I love the way that this looks because these are just some collapsible buns, but by using really cute hair accessories, specifically these butterfly hair clips, it looks really elven and really cute from the front. And from the back, it also has a really cute and really unique look, especially because I'm not using any bobby pins or hair ties to anchor these buns down, so they look really full and really fluffy. Our next hairstyle is going to be a variation of the last one that we did. So first, I'm going to separate the top section of my hair, and then I'm going to clip that away 
away temporarily. And then with the bottom half of my hair, I'm splitting this down the center. And then taking one fourth of my hair, I'm again twisting away from my face and wrapping it around itself until it collapses into a bun. And then I'm clipping that in place with a butterfly hair clip. And then I'm repeating this again on the other side. And then I'm releasing the top part of my hair, splitting that down the center, and again taking one fourth of my hair and twisting it away from my face until it collapses into a bun, and I'm clipping that in place with a butterfly clip. And then I'm repeating on the other side. So overall, I've done four sections of hair, four little collapsible buns, and they're all clipped away with butterfly hair clips. And that's it for this hairstyle. Again, I love how casual this hairstyle is. It looks really adorable, especially with these butterfly hair clips. Then for our next hairstyle, I am not going to use any hair ties or any bobby pins to keep these in place. So this is definitely a really great hairstyle to do on the go when you don't have any like hair accessories to hold up your hair, but you need to get it out of your face. So again, my hair is sectioned straight down the center and I'm twisting my hair away from my face all the way until I reach the bottom. And then I'm literally taking this and tying it into a regular knot. So I'm twisting it up against itself and then I'm looping the hair through and then I'm pulling it tight that it creates a knot at the base. And then I'm going to repeat this on the other side. And literally that's it for this hairstyle. This is actually my favorite hairstyle to wear when I'm out because I always like to wear my hair down and have my cute, beautiful cascading waves. But then at some point I start to get really sweaty and my hair is all in my face and I don't have any hair ties on me. So I will literally just tie my hair into knots and it is just so refreshing to get all of my hair out of the way. And it looks really cute too. And it actually does stay in place. And to take these out is really simple. You just have to unwork the knot at the base of the hair and it just slides right out. So for our last hairstyle, it's going to be the same concept. I'm going to gather all of my hair into a low ponytail and I'm going to twist it off to one direction until I reach the end of my hair. And then again, I'm going to wrap this around my hand and then loop it through itself to tie it into a knot. And honestly, this is my most worn daily hairstyle. I know it's so easy and so simple. I just don't really keep hair ties on hand. I know I should, but when I don't have a hair tie on hand, I just tie my hair in a knot and it also looks looks really amazing to be honest. And if you're having issues with keeping this in place, if you have any sort of stick on hand, it could be a pencil even, you can just stick this through your hair and it'll help keep in place. So I'm going to demonstrate this method with this little hair stick that I have. Entering from one side of the bun, you want to angle this upwards and then you want to push it downwards and angle it downwards so that you're kind of going in a U shape and that's going to help pin the hair against your head. Personally speaking, I don't really need to use anything to secure this bun in place. But if you have a little bit of shorter hair and it's kind of slipping through, you can definitely use any stick that you have on hand. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. I've been meaning to make this video for a long time because, you know, for all of the glamorous hairstyles that I do, realistically, I pretty much only wear these on a daily basis because I'm really, really lazy. And I hope you guys found some of these to be helpful and I hope you guys enjoy wearing them during the summer. Again, thank you so much to The Inky List for sponsoring this video. You can check out all of the products that I've used in this video in the description box below. And again, you can also use their hair recipe builder to figure out exactly what products would work best for your hair type. So thank you so much as usual to my lovely Patreon supporters. Thank you so much to CKL, Jay, Chelsea, Selena, Gabrielle, Kina Cradone, Tiffany, Sweet Moon Bubble, Georgia, Ruby, question mark, Lena's Rain, Rebecca, Gregorio, Tina, Kylan, Carla, Yoselin, Emma, Winna, Emily, Alona, Yu, Kay, Lara, Kathy, Erica, Celine, Elena, Karen, Angie, and Luna Rose. Thank you guys so much. I love you all. And I will see you guys again next week.